The Bank of France known in French as the Banque de France, headquartered in Paris, is the central bank of France. It is an independent institution, member of the Eurosystem since 1999. Its three main missions, as defined by its statuses, are to drive the French monetary strategy, ensure financial steadiness and provide services to households, small and medium businesses and the French state. It is a member of the European System of Central Banks, which consists of the European Central Bank and the National Central Banks of all European Union members. History <inaudible> <inaudible> Central banking before the Bank of France The Kingdom of France's first experiment with a central bank was the Banque Générale, Banque Générale Privé or General Private Bank, set up by John Law at the behest of the Duke of Orléans after the death of Louis XIV. It was meant to stimulate France's stagnant economy and pay down its staggering national debt acquired from Louis XIV's wars, including the War of the Spanish Succession. It was nationalized in December 1718 at Law's request and formally renamed the Bank Royale a month later. It saw great initial success, increasing industry 60% in two years, but Law's mercantilist policies saw him seek to establish large monopolies, leading to the Mississippi bubble. The collapse of the Mississippi Company and the Bank Royale tarnished the word bank, bank so much that France abandoned central banking for almost a century, possibly precipitating Louis XVI's economic crisis and the French Revolution. Later successors like La Caisse de Scompte from 1776 to 1793 and La Caisse de Scompte du Commerce from 1797 to 1803 used the word caisse instead, until Napoleon retook the term with La Banque de France. Bank of France in 1800 Topic <inaudible> <inaudible> Bank of France In 1800 financial power in France was in the hands of about 10 to 15 banking houses whose founders in most cases came from Switzerland in the second half of the 18th century These bankers were deeply involved in the agitations leading up to the French Revolution when the revolutionary violence got out of hand, they orchestrated the rise of Napoleon, whom they regarded as the restorer of order. As a reward for their support, Napoleon, in 1800, gave the bankers a monopoly over French finance by giving them control of the new Bank of France, Bank de France. Banker Claude Perrier drafted the first statutes and Emmanuel Cretet was the first governor. For the first 15 years it was the sole issuer of bank notes in Paris, and this privilege was extended to other financially important cities and the rest of the country by 1848. The bank was also instrumental in the creation of the Latin Monetary Union in 1865. The countries of France, Belgium, Italy, and the Swiss Confederation established the LMU franc as a common bimetallic currency. In World War I, the Bank of France sold short-term treasury bonds abroad to help pay for wartime expenditures. France abandoned the gold standard shortly after the outbreak of war. Debts amounted to approximately 42 billion francs by 1919. Following the war, the bank sought to re-establish the gold standard and acquired capital from a number of American and British banking syndicates to defend the franc from exchange rate fluctuations. The bank also began to hoard gold reserves and, at its peak, held 28.3% of the world's gold stock only behind the United States at 30.4%. Some scholars have asserted that this gold accumulation was a contributing factor to the Great Depression. Under Émile Moreau, governor from 1926 to 1930, the bank consolidated gold reserves created a stabilization insurance fund funds destabilization, and tested new monetary policies in the wake of a global depression. Jean-Claude Trichet, governor from 1993 to 2003, was the final governor of the bank until the establishment of the European Central Bank in June 1998. Today, the ECB sets monetary policy and oversees price stability for all countries in the Eurozone, including France. Timeline 1800 – Creation of the Bank of France by Napoleon Bonaparte 
the 14th of April 1803, the new bank received its first official charter granting it the exclusive right to issue paper money in Paris for 15 years. The 22nd of April 1806, a new law replaced the Central Committee with a governor and two deputy governors. All three were appointed by the emperor. Decree dated the 16th of January 1808 set out the basic statutes which were to govern the bank's operations until 1936. Decree on 6 March 1808 authorized the bank to purchase the former mansion of the Count of Toulouse in the Rue de la Vrilière in Paris for its headquarters. 1808–1936 The bank's notes became legal tender, expansion of the branch network 1936–1945 Nationalization 1973 Rewriting of the bank's statutes 1993A reform granted the bank independence, in order to ensure price stability, regardless of domestic politics. This reform cleared the path for the European Monetary Union. 1998 entered into the European system of central banks 2002 implementation of the Euro bank notes and coins in France 2003 Christian Neuer becomes governor of the Bank of France 2008 implements quantitative easing to manage the financial crisis 2015 François Villeroy de Galhau replaces Christian Neuer. The bank distributes dividends to the French state of €4.5 billion Euros in 2016 and €5.0 billion Euros in 2017. <laughs> Activities The Bank of France is responsible for three missions, monetary strategy, financial steadiness and services to the economy. <laughs> monetary strategy The Bank of France contributes to the design of the monetary policy of the Eurozone through macroeconomic research and forecast and by taking part in the deliberations on ECB decisions and implements it in France. It is also the guardian of currency, it prints euro bank notes it is the largest printer of euro notes and manages the circulation of bank notes and coins. It also participates in the fight against counterfeit money, by training bank employees, merchants, police, etc. The Bank of France establishes France's balance of payments and manages part of the foreign exchange reserves of the ECB. Financial steadiness The Bank of France is responsible for overseeing the French financial sector, through its subsidiary ACPR Autorité de Contrôle Prudential et de Resolution. It assesses risks and weaknesses of the financial system in 2018. The French financial sector is composed of 777 banks and 827 insurance and mutual insurance companies. It also monitors payment systems and means, and publishes the Financial Stability Review Revue de la Stabilité Financière. Services to the economy The Bank of France provides services to households, businesses and the French state. Households. The Bank of France is in charge of offering services households in severe financial difficulty. This includes the management of over-indebtedness one of the major tasks of the local branches of the bank, and the guarantee to an access to basic banking services for everyone, such as the right to a basic bank account. It is also in charge of financial and economic education of the general public, by developing an economic culture among specific populations like youngsters and households in severe financial difficulty. This includes sensitizing high school students, providing online information and educational services, training social workers and the future launch of the French Cité de l'Économie et de la Monnaie a museum based in the 17th district of Paris, to be opened in 2019. Businesses <inaudible> 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 The Bank of France provides company ratings for non-listed companies, which can for instance be used by business leaders to obtain credit from their bank. 
It also manages credit mediation, mediation between companies and their banks, their credit insurers, etc., and proposes support to very small businesses, advice for their development and needs. The Bank of France publishes a number of economic surveys, national and regional statistics, destined to businesses. Topic: <inaudible> French state. The Bank of France is in charge of services for the French state. It holds the account and manages the means of payment of the treasury and some public companies. It manages auctions of public securities. Finally, it establishes the balance of payments. Topic: <inaudible> Linkage with the ESCB. On 1 June 1998, a new institution was created, the European Central Bank ECB, charged with steering the single monetary policy for the euro. The body formed by the ECB, and the National Central Banks NCB of all the member states of the European Union, constitute the European System of Central Banks ESCB. The ESCB is an institutional framework of a single monetary policy for the euro. Topic: Financial Crisis of 2007-2008. Following the financial crisis of 2007-2008, the Bank of France implemented quantitative easing for the account of the ECB. Topic: Governance. The Governor of the Bank of France has been François Villeroy de Galhau, since 1 November 2015. He presides over the Bank's General Council, the body responsible for deliberating on all matters relating to non-Eurosystem activities. The first Deputy Governor is Denis Beau and the second Deputy Governor is Sylvie Gollard. <laughs> Key figures In 2017, the main key figures of the Bank of France are the following Number of full-time employees, 11,021 Regional branches, 95 Dividend distributed to the French state, 5 billion euros Net foreign exchange reserves, 13.3 billion euros Gold reserves, 84.7 billion euros Gold stock in France, 2,436 tonnes Controversy In 2010, the French government's Autorité de la Concurrence the department in charge of regulating competition fined 11 banks, including Bank of France, the sum of €384,900,000 for colluding to charge unjustified fees on check processing, especially for extra fees charged during the transition from paper check transfer to «exchanges check image» electronic transfer. See also Economy of France Euro French franc Governor of the Bank de France